guys welcome back for another video so today I'm very excited to do this video because soon as I heard that my girl Destiny Godly started a new business I hopped on it as soon as I found out of course I wanted to support her I'm sure y'all know who she is um she doing incredible makeup like I love her makeup she just bomb. I don't know. I just love her. She just dope. So I just wanted to come and just show you guys the new gym blender because um, I did look on YouTube and it's not like a lot of reviews. I did see one girl do a review, but yeah. But if you go on Instagram, I see a couple of people showing pictures and everything. So I just wanted to come and just show you guys. When I purchased my gym blender, it came in a little box like this and I opened it. I was so excited. I opened it. Okay. So yeah, and I did use it. I noticed on the other review, you gotta get the hang of this. You know, like we used to the beauty blender or whatever, but I just wanted to find what works for me so I can come and show y'all. So I only used it like two times, honestly. So I'm just gonna show you guys. So yeah, so it comes in a box like this. So when you open it, they have all kind of little, little strings in here, so cute. And it have a thank you card, and I haven't opened it yet. And also, I purchased this one. This is what I purchased. I forgot the name of it. I'll leave it across once I find out, because I hate to say the wrong thing. But I purchased this, only this, and I got a gift. And this was my gift. So, um, this was wrapped also in one of these. So, let me see what this is, because I didn't open it, as you can see. I didn't even um, purchase these like I didn't purchase a lot of stuff on the site because you know I wanted to see how it worked first you know so I only bought one thing and then I was like okay if I like it then I'll purchase more so yeah so I'm happy I got these I think this is called the trillion I, I don't know but these little triangle little thing this is cute I think this is for like contour but we're gonna try it today okay the first thing I'm going to do is use my black radiance shine control trick because I get real oily like right here okay so now I'm back and I brought y'all up a little closer and excuse my hair, I fix it at the end. So now I'm back from washing my blenders and let's just jump right into this video. So, okay, so since this product claims, you know, not to absorb a lot of our product, I'm going to be using my little, little makeup pen, put everything on. And the first thing I'm going to do is color correct and I'm using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color orange, like always. Okay, so yeah, see this little bit I put? Little bit. So I'm gonna see how far this go. So I'm just gonna take a little, like on a corner, I guess. Like that. Ooh, okay. Wow, this is a lot. This is a lot already. So I'm gonna put some on this side. Okay, okay, still a lot. Okay, so I'm gonna put some right here. Yeah. So I'm gonna blend it. Ooh. I'm gonna take it up. Uh, okay, that little dot was a little bit too much. Y'all, do not put a lot of product uh, on your gym blender. Okay, I'm gonna put some under here. I put it entirely too much. Okay, now I know. I know next time. So now I'm going to take my um, Kat Von D Lock It Found um, my Kat Von D Lock It Concealer, and I'm putting a little dot. Do you see this? I'm gonna dip, dip it in there. Yeah. Okay, so maybe I can put a little bit more. But girl, I was scared. You seen what happened the first time? So yeah, I'm just trying to balance out this orange. Correct because this is that's too much. Okay. Oh. Now I put a lot. And like I said, I only use this twice, so I'm gonna get the hang of it. You definitely use less product, so. And I don't know how to use this little. Okay, 
okay y'all of course I wouldn't have corrector all over my face like this but I was just trying to so balance look how much product I have left <laughs> from my um my orange color corrector in my um my concealer it's okay we learning together like I said I only did this twice so for my foundation I'm going to be using my true match foundation in the Lumi and the reason why I'm using this one today because they have a pump and I can control how much I'm using okay this is one pump of the foundation I'm using this and I'm gonna use this side because I feel like I have more control and it's so soft you guys and it's so pretty like so pretty this is how it looks see? so I'm gonna dip my gem blender in here And I'm just going to do the dabbing motion because I feel like I have more control. Yeah, this is so soft. Oh my gosh. Yes, honey. So now I'm just going to dab it again and do the other side. Okay, so I dabbed it again because I'm going getting to like my mouth area and I have dark pigmentation around there and I want more coverage. So Yes, honey. I really like this, you guys. I want some mouth. Okay, I'm dabbing stuff. it again and I'm getting low, so I will do like this is my last. Mm, let me see. I'm gonna see. I might need like a little half a little pump. Seamless, like no lines of demarcation or anything. Like y'all see? You see this? Do y'all see this? Yes, honey. Like, I don't know why people is not reviewing this product. Like, look at this. This is how much I have left. I'm going to see if I can make it. If not, I'm going to do like a little pump. I think it's all clean so now I'm going to highlight and I'm using my LA girl pro concealer in the color medium beige and I'm gonna take it and squeeze it on here cuz I don't want to use too much product so I just uh, that's probably too much I don't know so of course I'm going to use this side I'm gonna take the back of the blender and smooth out my edges right there. I definitely put too much concealer on the palette but I'm gonna try to use it let's see if I can just build it up I'm gonna start right here just in case it's too much for my nose but I'm gonna highlight the top right here my forehead And this is how much highlight I still have left. 
so you definitely save a lot of product using the gem blender so yeah so now I'm going to contour and I'm using my black opal foundation stick in the, in the color hazelnut like always so this is the second one I used my first one to color correct with yeah so how am I going to use this first I did the corner but now I'm going to just use this side right here because yeah I will be all day doing it like that so So I'm going to do the other side. Right. And y'all know I love to bronze and contour and all of that. So, and excuse my wig y'all, I'm going to fix it at the end. Yes. Yes, Destiny, come through with the gem blender y'all. I'm feeling this. I'm going to never have to buy another beauty blender let's do this nose contour and I'm gonna take this side right here Dip it. okay and I'm gonna bring it downwards like that So now I'm going to smash this up a little bit and I'm going to use this side right here. I'm just going to take it. You know. Oh, I'm so glad I got this. Thank you so much, Destiny, for this free gift. And it's not just me that got a free gift because like I said, she don't know me. Um, I did see other people say that they received gifts, but I thought it was because they was like the first batch going out and I, I'm not the first batch. so. Yeah, she's still giving them. I don't see why people is not talking about this product. Like, I cannot believe people is not talking about this gym blender. When that little sponge came out, everybody was talking about it. You've seen it all over. I don't know. Can you use this with powder? I don't know. We're going to learn today. So I'm going to take my Sasha Buttercup setting powder and I'm going to set the highlighted areas on my face. Ha! Okay, Jim Blender, come through, honey. Yes. Uh. It's a little patchy, but I bet my blender wouldn't be wet. My Jim Blender wouldn't be kind of So you can definitely use it with your powder and as you see like when I first applied it was like a little patchy but if you keep doing a little tapping dabbing or whatever you want to call it if you keep doing that motion like it spreads out So now let's set my face. I'm going to use my CoverGirl translucent powder. And I guess I use my gem blender for that also. Why not? The back of it. Hmm. Let me switch over to this side. Okay, I think I like to put the powder on with this side instead of the back. Yeah. 
and I am in here kind of sweating with the lights and everything so but it's still doing good okay so now I'm going to um, bronze with my covergirl queen bronzer in the color ebony bronze and I'm using this again yeah I'm gonna finish my makeup and then I'll be right back to show you guys how everything came together but I am so impressed with this gem blender it is definitely worth the money definitely so yeah I'll be back Okay, you guys, I'm back, and I just added my lipstick, put on my um, under eye mascara, and kind of fixed my hair a little bit. And you guys, this is my Princess Curl hair from my Lux collection, and I'm gonna leave all the information down below. Don't forget to go check out my site and get y'all some good quality, affordable hair, okay? So anyway, <laughs> okay, so I showed you guys everything, how I use my gem blender. Yeah. I basically did everything with my gem blender. Like everything, everything that I used to do with my beauty blender, I did it with my gem blender. I love the fact that this product is very easy to clean. You guys, if you haven't purchased a gem blender, you need to you know it's all about preference you're going to learn what you like it's different so I have to get used to it but I think I did a damn good job today okay I mean I'm just saying this is just my third time using it but it was my first time like doing highlighting with it and using powders with it today was my first time I did it right here with you guys okay so I am so happy with the gem blender watching I'm gonna leave a link down below to um, her website this product is bomb and I see her going very far with this product like seriously okay like I'm so proud of you Destiny if you watch this thank you so much for the gift thank you guys so much for watching thumbs up this video questions video requests all that good stuff girl comment down below let me know what you think of the gym blender from watching me okay so yeah talk to you guys later bye bye